150 Japanese politicians visited a controversial shrine to the war dead on the eve of President Obama's arrival in Tokyo. The visits are criticized by the U.S. and Japan's Asian neighbors because 14 Class A war criminals are memorialized at Yasukuni. Publicly, Japanese politicians played down the symbolism of today's visit. As this was my own personal visit, I don't believe that it will have any effect on the U.S. president's visit. Earlier this week, Prime Minister Abe sent a memorial gift to the shrine but did not go. In Seoul, a stop on Obama's Asian visit. South Korean officials say there's unusual activity at the North's nuclear test site. The defense ministry said it may signal a weapons test or may just be a diversion. North Korean media have condemned Obama's trip to Asia. Friday is also Army Day in North Korea, always a day to show its military muscle. Executives and shareholders of the company that owned the ferry which sank last Wednesday can't leave South Korea, pending an investigation into the disaster. Also, six more crew members of the ferry have been detained, suspected of negligence and abandoning ship and its passengers. According to some news reports, the captain may face life in prison. Meantime, divers have now pulled 121 bodies from the hull of the sunken ferry, and more than 180 people are still missing. Many of them are high school students who'd been on a school outing. Hi, I'm Tui Vu, the host of Link Asia. Catch Link Asia every Friday on Link TV, 9.30 p.m. Eastern, 6.30 p.m. Pacific. Check our website for local listings on KCET Los Angeles and PBS's The World Channel.